ओके हे गाइस वेलकम बैक अगेन सो इफ यू आर विलिंग टू स्टार्ट एनी एमेजन एफिलिएट ब्लॉग एंड स्टिल कंफ्यूज व्हाट टाइप ऑफ ब्लॉग स्ट्रक्चर यू हैव टू फॉलो व्हाट आर द पोटेंशियल ऑफ मेकिंग इनकम हाउ एग्जैक्टली यू कैन मोनेटाइज योर एमेजन एफिलिएट ब्लॉग सो एवरीथिंग आई विल बी कवरिंग हियर इन दिस वीडियो दिस वीडियो विल बी एन इंट्रोडक्टरी वीडियो इफ द रिस्पांस विल बी गुड एंड यू वांटेड मी टू मेक मोर वीडियोस ऑन दिस टॉपिक सच एज सर्टेन अर्निंग प्रूफ्स हाउ मच मनी आई मेड यूजिंग द सेम स्ट्रेटजी देन मेक श्योर यू प्रोवाइड कमेंट इन द comment box so in the future i will make a couple of videos so you will get a good confidence whether you should go with an amazon affiliate blog or not hey guys my name is kirti shwas i am from the bloggingwise.com on this channel i do provide content all about affiliate marketing blogging passive incomes and try to upload at least one videos every week so make sure you subscribe to this channel and also stay tuned and click to the bell icon so you will keep getting all the notifications of future videos without wasting time let's go to the screen and there i will show you two examples the two blogs which are based on the amazon affiliate and how exactly they are been designed so here we are on the screen first of all guys i will show you my own blog with the name of soundproofidea.com this blog is more about a blog okay so what happen is if you will open any of this blog post you should be able to see it has a content which is written around a certain topic and when you will scroll down this particular content in the middle of that you will find certain amazon affiliate products so there you can see this is a product from the amazon if somebody will click to that it will route them to the local amazon center so if you are in the us you will be uh, go to the amazon.com it will redirect you to the amazon.com if you are in the uk you will redirect it to the .co.uk similarly for different countries so this is a blog which is all around amazon affiliate okay where i'm more focusing around the content now if you are asking me how i have imported this so guys this kind of blogs are been designed using a special plugin the name of the plugin is get aawp so this is the plugin which has its internal api which will connect with your amazon affiliate account and it will try to pull all the product detail from that and will auto populate on your blog so it will be a simple code which you have to paste on your website and all this product will be imported in your website so guys this is something which i have designed using the get aawp plugin and this blog has a more structure all around a blog kind of content you will you will share the information via uh, via blogs and within the blogs you will start promoting the amazon product if the user will like your content they will click to that product and will be redirected to the amazon now within the 24 hours if they will make any purchase you will make income that is how this whole model works i hope you got an idea now let me take you to the another website which is also based on the amazon affiliate but not like as in a blog type of structure that side is more about an e-commerce type of structure and at the end i will summarize which one you have to go in order to get an organic traffic or more income sources okay so this is another website with the name of shoppingsigma.com not owned by me but one of my family members and basically what this site is does is you can see here this is uh, more of a general category website which more focusing around the kitchen products and on this website you should be able to see there are couple of products if you will click to any of this product it will open to that particular window in a different url and there you should be able to see the same structure same add to cart button and all the detail as you have seen on the amazon website so there you will be having an image this is a brief description and there they actually if you will click to this one it will route you to the amazon website so this is how this whole model works if you will design your website like in shoppingsigma.com but in this particular site guys you need to use a plugin which is a woozon that you can see this is the plugin which that particular website is using if you wanted to purchase any of this plugin i will provide the link in the description so you can design the website accordingly and you wanted me to make a more videos on how this website sites are been designed using this plugin then also provide the comment in the comment box so in the future i will also make a video how you can design that website now when it comes to this website guys how this website has been designed is if you will install this plugin woozon on your website it has an options like you can import the product directly from the amazon so i just click to that one right and there you can see it has a this kind of image this has a summary this has a description the same thing is pulled up using this plugin inside your website and same thing will be display here if you wanted to sell such kind of product on your website either you can add as an add to cart button but here they have added a button called view on amazon because they are routing user to the amazon so that whenever user will go to the amazon and will make any purchase starting from 2 
2% to 12% they will start making commission. So this is how these two websites are been designed. So if I will go back to the home page, you will be having a certain category, the same way as you have seen on the Amazon, you will be having a certain products which is featured on the home page. And if you directly wanted to check on Amazon, you can go with that. So I hope you got a good idea. What is the true structure of your website? So if I would like, if I would like to summarize this one, guys, this is the website owned by me, which is mainly designed using this AAWP plugin only for importing the products. Okay. Rest all this website is, is a WordPress website, nothing different. Okay. And this is again a WordPress website, but it is using a plugin with the name of a WooZone and it actually helpful to import the product from the Amazon. So this way guys, you can design two websites. Now, if you are planning to start your blog, which approach you should go for? What type of website structure you should have? So there are a couple of things you have to understand. So number one is guys, if you will try to design a website kind of soundproofidea.com, then guys, you will need extra effort because there you will be doing a keyword research and there you will be doing a search engine optimization. There you will be writing a content and within the content, you are trying to promote the product. Okay. So this is a very, very, uh, it's, it's, it's just like it's a blog and in the blog, you are promoting your content. So ultimately you are putting your hard effort. You will need your time in order to make this site helpful content than only user will buy. But when it comes to shoppingsigma.com guys, this you should only go with if you have no time to start any blog, but you have certain product, the product could be of yours or could be of Amazon. You can add any product. And if you have your own e-commerce website or you have any something wherever you are selling certain products, in that case, guys, you can go with this one because this will require a list of what. What you need is single image with a brief description of the product and just add on your website. User will visit to the Amazon and they will make a purchase. So guys, if you're looking for a less effort, then you can go with a site like shoppingsigma.com. But if you have your hard effort you wanted to put inside your website, then you will go with a soundproof idea. Now, this is kind of an effort. Now let's talk about how, exa uh, how exactly you will get a traffic. Okay, guys, so if your website is designed using soundproofidea.com pattern, in that case, guys, you will get a good amount of search engine organic traffic even you will get a because your keyword will start ranking in the search engine and that's why based on that keyword the people will come to your website they will visit your blog to get answer for a specific query and while you're answering that query in the middle of that you can suggest them certain products and they will make a purchase so it's more of a helping in nature where the traffic will come automatically via google organic or any search engine organic search but when it comes to shopping sigma the organic traffic potential will be less than one percent until you will provide a detailed summary about that product which might rank in the google Otherwise, you will not get any organic traffic by mistake. If you will get something that is okay, but not 100% you will get organic traffic. So in this case, guys, your traffic source of media will be only social media marketing or maybe any paid media marketing. So you have to either run a Facebook campaign or a Google AdWord campaign, or might be you have to share your website on various social media platform. Then only you will get traffic on your website because this website is just just sharing the products right if the people wanted to buy a product then only they will come but on this website the people are coming there to get certain solution of a particular problem and in result they are purchasing certain products and you will make money so from my perspective if you have money to invest if you have a budget to do paid advertisement then you can start with a shopping sigma kind of website or you might have a certain network where you wanted to promote your website, where the users are already exist. You just have to share your website. If such kind of platform you already have, such as a well-established YouTube channel, or I should say well-established community or a group, then if you wanted to share this blog, you must share it though so that you will get a good advantage. And the way these two websites are designed is using this two plugin and both of these websites are hosted in WordPress. Okay. So guys, this is how the Amazon affiliate blog structure should be. And you can go with both approaches, whatever fits best to you. In case you wanted me to make more videos on this one, make sure you provide the comment which one you want a real case study and which blog is making how much income. I don't have a stat for this particular site, but I have absolute stat for my site soundproofidea.com. So I can show you how much this website is making every month selling Amazon products. Okay, so that's all for today, guys. And uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. If this is so, make sure you provide your valuable comment. See you in the future one. Thank you very much for being a part of this channel.